The Soul of Santa isn't just about spreading holiday cheer during the season. It's a year-round undertaking. Tucker Lott and Dennis Powell from the Soul of Santa Do Good Foundation join us this morning to talk about cultivating community and why representation matters. Thanks so much for chatting with us today. First of all, I, lo I love the picture behind you guys. <laughs> So tell us about your foundation and what the mission is. Well, let me start out really quickly. Uh, our purpose and our mission is to support uh, children and families in disenfranchised and disabled communities in the areas of education and entrepreneurship through arts and culture. It's a lot of words, but <laughs> that's break down one, one, one day at a time. I love that. So what are you doing to actually do that and bring this to the community? So through our foundation, uh, we have several programs. Um, you know, we have a monthly food distribution that we partner with. Uh, we serve over 200 families a month, give out about 25,000 pounds of food. We also have a food pantry that we help with. Uh, we also recently just gave out Thanksgiving baskets and gift cards. Uh, but throughout the year on our website, you can nominate people that are in need and we do good 365. So, uh, wow. you know, when, when you think about the holidays, people think about cheer and we try to bring that feeling all year round. I love that you you do it year round because there are so many things around the holiday and it's almost like people are, are forgotten about in, in a sense. What do you have coming up and how can we see what you guys are doing? Well, uh, we, we're getting ready to host our kickoff to our annual holiday event. So uh, tomorrow evening we have our tree lighting ceremony and the historic 18th of Vine, this is 6 p.m. Uh, followed by that is our holiday benefit concert. Uh, we have featured this year Layla Hathaway and Tony Terry. Uh, it's at the gym theater, so we still have tickets available. You can go on our website, uh, solarsound.org, uh, to purchase tickets. All the proceeds go back to the foundation and our mission of doing good through 65. Uh, then Saturday morning, we have a free community breakfast and toy giveaway at the Negro League Baseball Museum. Uh, so come on out. You know, we have a book we're going to read to the children as well. And then we're doing it again next week. So next Friday, we're doing a tree lighting uh, at the Shops and Blue Parkway at 6 p.m. And then uh, breakfast and toy giveaway the following morning at 9. Mm -hmm. So our inaugural event in uh, 18th of Ryan was the first ever tree lighting in that area. And then our tree lighting this year at Shops and Blue Parkway would be the first ever lighting there. So Pretty uh, again, amazing. What's the reaction like from the community when you do these events and you're able to give back in this way? Well, it's been great. It really truly has been tremendous. And that's why we're, we're, we're supporting an, an intimate evening because this really is about community and connectivity, diversity, and inclusion. We want everybody involved in what we're doing. So when they, those children saw that first tree lighting a couple of years ago, it, it was amazing for them. So that's why we were focusing on the disenfranchised communities. And we're going to continue to do that and spread this all over the city. Well, you guys keep spreading that cheer and joy. Tucker and Dennis, we look forward to learning more when the Soul of Santa takes over Black Excellence Casey's Instagram tomorrow. We will definitely be watching. Thank you for everything that you do. Keep slaying. <laughs> <laughs> and, and do good 365. We will. All right. Thank you.